What's good, YouTube? I am finally back in Tampa, Florida, back at my home recording. I'm telling you, this summer I'm going to go crazy. Sorry for that small hiatus, but the transition from Virginia to Florida, finding a job, all that good stuff, it got a little hectic. But I am back, and we're starting my first video back in home with a banger. I got my hands on this pair right here. So we're going to go into an in-depth review of the Jordan 4 University Blue. So if you are new to the channel or tuning in for the first time, hit that subscribe button, drop a like on this video, and welcome to QSO Kicks. This shoe overall may seem simple with just an all over blue, but the details do make this shoe. And starting off with the box, it did come in that special packaging with the white lid, University Blue Flight Man, Jump Man, as well as the air on the side. And then at the bottom, it does feature that cement coloring, of course. The entire shoe is dressed in that University Blue suede super soft and does have a little bit of backstroke to it university blue cages as well as university blue laces the tongue and sock liner also sport that university blue the back of the tongue is black with air jordan upside down the soles of the shoe is all black with the university blue jump man midsole gray black white with a white air unit you can see that peeking through black eyelids throughout and what really makes this shoe pop is those cement hints throughout the shoe you can see it on the midsole front and back on the medial and lateral side of the shoe cement wings and of course you got the cement heel tab with the black jump man sitting right in the center Last but not least, heading to the bottom of the shoe, the outsole features a gray, black, and white coloring. And of course, you have the University Blue Hits on the top, as well as that Jumpman sitting right in the middle. The last detail I want to hit on is going back to the tongue. Of course, you have the standard Jordan 4 Jumpman with flight underneath in white. But what a lot of people do not like is that hang tab paying homage to the old basketball jerseys of the NBA. Getting into my thoughts on the shoe, I absolutely love this pair. It is a beautiful, beautiful shoe. And as you can see from the background, North Carolina jersey here, wearing a North Carolina jersey right now. Michael Jordan up at the top. I am a huge North Carolina fan. If you have been tuning in for a while, I'm a huge Michael Jordan fan. So this shoe is a must. Unfortunately, I do not have my own pair yet. I was gifted this pair uh, just to do this review for you guys by my brother. It is, it is his shoe, excuse me. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get my hands on this shoe. I can guarantee it. This is probably going to be one of the very few shoes I pay resale for. I absolutely love this shoe. The all university blue suede on there is different. When I get my pair, I'm going to try to convince my brother to do the same thing. When I get my personal pair, this is gone. I've seen a lot of YouTubers, a lot of people cut that tag and it looks beautiful. Um, I don't think there's something necessarily wrong with it being there, but for me, it's just a little bit too much for the tongue. So I'm definitely gonna cut that off. I know a lot of people have done so and it looks extremely dope. But this is a beautiful shoe, a must cop. If you got it for retail, definitely keep this shoe. Don't just go out there trying to you know, get the fast buck or whatever, I'm telling you. Looking down the road, you're gonna want this shoe. And I really love what Jordan Brand is doing, paying homage to the college PEs, but then turning them, you know, twisting them a little bit to make them a general release so that the fans of North Carolina and, of course, the fans of the sneaker world can get a little taste of what that PE life is like. It's just a beautiful shoe. And the cement coloring on here, oh my gosh. From when I first seen leaks of this shoe on Z Sneakerheads, on Instagram, I fell in love with this shoe. I'm going to get my own pair. I promise you, I'm definitely going to get my own pair. Please let me know what you guys think about the laces. 
I think it's a little bit too much university blue. Let me know that in the comment section. Once I get my own pair, I'm definitely gonna throw some white laces on there. I've seen a lot of people with them. I've seen a lot of people with black laces too, it's pretty dope. But I don't really like the color black as much as the color white. So definitely gonna throw some white laces on that. It's just a beautiful shoe, you can't go wrong with this. Definitely a very dope shoe to have, especially for the summer coming up. I'm telling you, you walk outside, they go, they turning heads. They be like, hey, fuck. I'm telling you, very beautiful shoe, and the, and the quality is good. I'm not gonna lie, so if you guys are sitting back thinking about whether you should pull the trigger on resale, first of all, it's depending on how your pockets look, and I can't judge nobody else's pockets. Secondly, quality is up there. Definitely worth the buck. Got a, I don't know if you can see it, Got a little backstroke to it and everything. Premium quality, I love this shoe a lot. Um, although this is not my shoe, I will be treating you guys with the on foot. Shout out to my brother, he is providing the on foot for you guys. So you still get a look on how they look on the toe so you know if it's right for you. But with that being said, we're gonna go ahead and get to that on foot video. Please like the video if you did enjoy it. If you are new to the channel, Please hit that subscribe button. It helps me out a lot. I'm on the road to 1K right now. And with that being said, you know the quote, you know the motto. Aim high. Spread love. I'm out.